legend lives on from the Chippewa on down at the big lake they call Gitchagumi. The lake it is said never gives up for day. Live look at Lake Superior in Duluth this morning. You know that Gordon Lightfoot song, don't you? Of course. I lived in Duluth for three and a half years. I'm sure they played it nonstop up there, didn't they? Oh, yeah. Well, it's got a story behind it. It does. Today marks 40 years since the wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald, just as Gordon Lightfoot described in his song. The ship and its crew of 29 were lost during a storm on Lake Superior on November 10th, 1975. So much mystery around this. Happened suddenly, no distress signal. She went down 17 miles north-northwest of Whitefish Point, Michigan, the site of the Great Lake Shipwreck Museum. The Shipwreck Historical Society has conducted three underwater expeditions to the wreck. That's where these photos come from. Pretty remarkable to see that ship at the bottom of the sea, but uh, still a mystery as to uh, what went wrong. Right? I, I worked with uh, the news anchor, Dennis Anderson, sure. longtime news anchor, who was the first to go on air with that wreckage. With that breaking news? Yes, and it was really interesting to hear his stories sure. about how the news was gathered at that time 40 years ago. Hard to believe, yeah. but still a very painful memory for a lot of people up there, that's for sure. New